Having seen it on Monday morning, you've seen the, the students were sort of, what do we do? We're in a big bad world. But as the week progressed, you see the different roles of the, the students coming through. You see the, the guys you're leading. You see the guys you want to be led. You see the guys who are just stand back and think about things, which I've, I've actually felt very, very proud to be a part of. Well, I'm project manager for the site, I'm Tom. Uh, we're building the Kingsgate Bridge here. Uh, as you can see, we've had the excavations done and we had to dig down. Um, we've had a lot of problem with groundwater, uh, where we've, but we've managed to get the formwork down for the foundations. Really, what I've gained from this is an insight to what it's going to be like being employed as a civil engineer in the construction industry. This project starts about how things work in real life, not just the theory that we learn in the classroom. Going to construction area really gives you a perspective what kind of different works you get to do. If, when you go into the construction business as an engineer. It's yeah. helped out in a long way, I'll be honest, because this whole thing has actually given you a wee insight into what the real world actually is like, um, due to delays, having health and safety checks all the time, keeping control of your men. From a university point of view, the, it, it's key that their students learn the, the skills that they're going to have once they graduate. Today they are doing three projects, uh, the last time uh, I came, we were doing it, borrowing a yard of a, of a contractor down. Uh, so it is encouraging to see that more universities and more contractors are engaging with construction area. I've been very impressed with what I've seen, the enthusiasm of everybody involved from the students, the lecturers, and the people involved in training them from the different companies and the trainers themselves. Uh, the students seem to get a huge amount from it. For Construction Arium to, to give this opportunity to students, I think is a very, very good thing for the industry. And it's probably what we need because a lot of us feel that guys are coming out of university not having experienced life on site. And now the guys are coming out to run jobs and how do, you, how do you run a job if you haven't had a bit of experience? So what's really good is actually seeing real life problems and having to overcome them and put the things you learn in class into what you do in real life. So doing this and then going back to that you have a much better understanding which you can apply and then talk about um, especially for reports and exams you got you got stuff to talk about and it's a really good thing to be doing. Some of the students had never ha held a hammer before in their life before Monday. Today is Friday and they have actually built whole structures. They have set foundations, um, they have put concrete, set in uh, reinforcement. It was just fantastic. Construction area experience has been great. It boosts your confidence, boosts teamwork, gets to know more boys in your class. Although I've been at university all over a year, I've actually managed to meet and interact with more people in my class learn out what their strengths are, what my strengths are in terms of them and I've been able to fit my team around what I think the best person can do for each job. I can actually say that I, I've done that work, I, I, I can understand how these joiners are working, how, how much effort it takes to do that actual job. We've learned a lot about teamwork and also majorly about the construction Site experience. Business. Yeah. It also gives you a better insight of like if you're leading a team or something, you understand the work that they have to go in and you're a little bit more um, friendly and understanding when work doesn't go to plan because you yourself have been in that position. It teaches you about the real life delays that you'd find in construction and how to change programming that isn't set in stone. In class you don't really, you don't get to actually experience what it's like, but here I'm actually, I'm involved, I'm, I'm telling people to be safe, like what PPE to be wearing. Uh, it's, it's completely different. It's been, one, it's been a fantastic experience and it will help us in later life. And to somebody like myself who's never been on a construction site before, it's opened my eyes completely. Um, but it also makes me a wee bit excited for the future to what I'm actually going to go into. Fantastic opportunity for them to come here on site and uh, get them out of the classroom, show them what they will be doing later on. You need to get a whole understanding of yeah. how it's all done, how it all comes together. Like, you, you can go onto a site straight out of uni and not know, not know what you're doing. It's, yeah, it's tough work. It's tough work, but it's been fun. Yeah. Because a lot of the, the 
undergraduates that participated in the last 10 years have senior jobs and thus encourage other people and other uh, universities to engage with it and contractors, etc. To see it now, we've experienced it, everything is up. Barcelona Tower, the spires on it, the pavilion should hopefully in the next hour be complete. The bridge is there, the guys are on it, they're proud of it. So, yeah, on the whole I think this is a very, very good opportunity for both the students, universities, construction area, construction skills and indeed the employers.